Hey, what's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, JD Live, man. I'm live in the fact, man. And today, we're going to get into a little story time. Now, my community poll, I was asking y'all what type of videos y'all wanted me to post. And a lot of y'all was saying I should do story time. So, I'm like, okay, man. I'm going to bring out a little story time for y'all. Before we do, hit the like button, comment, subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's just get right into it, man. Y'all see the title of the video, man. Yes, yes, it's true. This is way back in the day, man. This is... Back in the day, back in the day, you know what I'm saying? It was back in the day. Like, I'm going to be up front, man. I'm a, I want y'all to, like, you know, get to know me and stuff. I'm going to be up front. I'm going to be honest, man. So, y'all see the title, man. I got curved by my coworker, man. Yes, I got curved, man. I got skirt. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got curved, bro. Like, really, nigga? Hey, players take L's, man. It's all good, man. It's part of life, you know? Players take L's, but, like... I just want to say this before we get into the story time, man. Don't don't try to pursue your coworker, bro. Don't try to make that work, man. Like, man, my dad told me after that. He said, man, never mix business with pleasure. I was like, man, you right, you right, man. Cause that messes up everything, bro. It's it's too much. I'm gonna get in depth. I'm gonna explain it and everything. But, man, don't be trying to do this. So, yeah. So back in the day, it was uh. It was about dang. It was a while ago. It was. It was. It was maybe about two or three years ago. I used to work in a movie theater, right? And this girl that I I worked with, you know, I'm gonna call her S. I ain't gonna say her name. You feel me? So S, you know, I used to work with S. You know what I'm saying? She was a cool girl. You know, we worked in the movie theater. You know, you know, how the movie theater got the concession stand. They got the uh, get the guest services. The guy that's ripping the tickets and stuff like that. You know, like. She would typically work at the concession stand. I would typically be up at the front, you know, tearing the tickets, man. Yeah, boy, your boy was tearing tickets. Your boy was tearing tickets. Give a hey, um uh, theater to the left, to the right, um uh, theater eight to the left, to the right. You know, I I don't know what I'm talking about, but yeah, like I, man, that was a while ago. Hey, but y'all let me know if you ever worked worked at movie theaters, cause movie theaters, hey, y'all get free movies and you get discounts on that popcorn and drink so hey it wasn't that bad but hey you know what i'm saying but let's get back into the story so i'm getting off track but yeah so like pretty much you know we were cool you know she was cool um cool girl you know what i'm saying like we were friends you know she was cool real chill real kind of quiet she didn't really talk too much you know what i'm saying hey sure yeah a little show that little body you know what i'm saying like i, I thought I, th I thought she looked good i ain't gonna lie you know like and she was like, she was new, like she was kind of new, cause like she started, cause like I I've been there for like maybe like a year already, and then she started like some months after or something like that. So she was fairly new, and like you know I was just like a lot of people when the when a new person start to work at the job, sometimes you would try to get to know them and everything, and try to welcome them and try to be cool with them. It was something like that, but then we end up becoming even more cool talking during the shifts and everything, you know, getting to know each other, all that stuff. So she, we became like real cool friends. So like, you know, like, uh, we, uh, we weren't like really like talking a whole, whole lot, but like gradually over time, you know what I'm saying? Like as shifts go on and on and on, y'all getting to know each other. You starting to know more about each other. Y'all got things in common. You like, you know, you like, us guys, you know, if we see a girl that look good, she got stuff in common, you feeling her vibe, you gonna try to pursue, right? But like, I remember I did, bro, and it just didn't work, bro. It just didn't work because like she kind of didn't want to because of the uh because of the job situation, you know, like because you're working together, right? Like I kind of got curved because she didn't want to date, you know, like. While we were working together, could have been that or she wasn't really feeling me. I don't know, but I, I know what didn't happen. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. You know what I'm saying? Players take L's. It is what it is. You feel me? But, uh, <laughs> yo, oh, man, even remembering this is wild, bro. Dang, that was a long time ago, man. Dang. Hey, I'm doing my thing though. I hey, you know, so I'm good though. You feel me? I'm good. But yeah, uh, pretty much what I was gonna say. What is that?
At this point, I don't know what is going on. Get it? Oh, somebody went to the bathroom. My bad, y'all. I'm like, looking through. I'm like, is it, is it like a ghost or something? Like somebody about to come and get me or something? Yeah, I think somebody just went to the bathroom. Okay, yeah, my bad, y'all. Um, but yeah, man, it just didn't work out. That was pretty much it. It wasn't really too much after that, y'all, to be honest with you. That was really simple story time but yeah i got curved like and i want to give y'all something man don't be trying to pursue people you work with man it's real messy it just doesn't work you know what i'm saying like just stick to dating people outside of your work job or try to pursue somebody outside of your work job because other parties get involved other people get involved people get talking gossip all that stuff man so just don't do it man you know if you like to hit the like button comment subscribe and i'm gonna see y'all the next one man peace the torch.